Welcome to another episode of Faith Explorations, the podcast where we delve deep into the teachings and principles of Christianity and embark on a transformative journey through the realms of faith and spirituality. I'm your host, Kenneth Garcia. In episode 64, we delve into a topic close to the heart of every believer, closer than close, the beauty of intimacy with God. Intimacy with God is a transformative and enriching aspect of the Christian faith, and we're excited to explore it further. But our exploration doesn't end here. For more insights that can enrich your journey of faith, be sure to visit us at BibleKeeper.com. So without further ado, let's dive in. Intimacy with God is a phrase that holds profound significance for many, but it may mean different things to different individuals. Some understand it as feeling a close connection with God, while others see it as gaining insights into His character and workings in our lives. No matter the perspective, intimacy with God is an integral part of being a Christian, an area of spiritual growth we must actively pursue. Through this intimacy, we can find true peace, joy, and hope in our lives. Let's start by understanding what intimacy truly means. Intimacy involves a feeling of connection, closeness, and familiarity between individuals. It stems from shared experiences, mutual respect, trust, and understanding, and it requires a level of vulnerability that allows both parties to feel safe expressing their thoughts, feelings, and desires with one another. It creates an emotional bond that provides comfort, security, and a sense of belonging. There are various forms of intimacy, such as physical, emotional, spiritual, and intellectual. Today, we focus on spiritual intimacy, which describes our connection with our higher power or faith, in this case, our relationship with God. It's fascinating that the elements that build intimacy in human relationships also apply to our relationship with God. Trust, a deep connection, and a sense of our relationship with Him and His love for us are crucial for this spiritual intimacy. The Bible provides numerous examples of individuals who experienced intimacy with God, from Moses at the burning bush to Jesus, praying in the Garden of Gethsemane. God desires a personal relationship with each of us. He calls us to draw near to Him and to love Him as He loves us. But how do we achieve this deep level of intimacy with God? To find out, we can explore the heart of intimacy. The heart of intimacy is built on trust and acceptance. We must trust that God knows what's best for us even when we don't fully comprehend His ways. We also need to accept His will even when it's challenging. When we actively seek a relationship with God through prayer, worship, and reading the scriptures, we open our hearts to allowing Him to have a more profound presence in our lives. True intimacy doesn't happen overnight. It takes time and effort from both parties involved. Just as human relationships require nurturing, an intimate fellowship with God requires us to make time for Him each day, listening to and learning from Him through His Word. So, how can we foster intimacy with God in our daily lives? It's a lifelong journey and it begins with prayer, approaching the Lord and asking Him to reveal Himself to us in meaningful and personal ways. Daily Bible reading is also a vital aspect of developing intimacy with God, as it helps us understand His character and will and stay attuned to His Spirit. But it doesn't stop there. We must be obedient to God's will, surrendering our own desires and letting Him lead us. Living a life of purity, charity, and humility reveals the kind of character He desires from us. And let's not forget the importance of fellowship with other believers. By coming together in worship, service, and prayer, we can grow closer to Him as a collective body of believers. As we grow in intimacy with God, we find true fulfillment and contentment in life. It allows us to experience His love, mercy, and grace on a deeper level. Having an intimate relationship with God helps us grow spiritually, emotionally, mentally, and physically as we learn more about the Lord and our faith. Furthermore, intimacy with God brings peace into our lives, providing us with hope, comfort, and joy that only He can provide. Surrendering ourselves to His will, even when it's hard, allows us to trust that He has great plans for us, plans to prosper us and give us hope. So how can we prepare for even greater intimacy with God? It starts with spending quality time alone with Him each day through prayer and Bible study. Being vulnerable and open about what's happening in our lives allows us to cultivate a more meaningful relationship with God. We can also develop intimacy with God through worship, pouring out our love for Him in song and expressing our gratitude and praise. 
Additionally, practicing quietness and stillness in God's presence helps us create an atmosphere conducive to intimate moments with Him. By taking the time to be still and just be with God, we experience His love and nearness on a deeper level. Before we wrap up, let's address some common misconceptions about intimacy with God. One misunderstanding is that it only occurs through specific activities or rituals. However, true intimacy with God is about recognizing and embracing His presence, not merely performing certain duties. Another misconception is that intimacy with God is solely based on emotional connections. While emotions may be present, the foundation of intimacy with God should be rooted in love and obedience, not just feelings. As we conclude, remember that God's invitation to intimacy is an open door for each of us. He longs for a personal relationship with us where we can experience His love, mercy, and grace. It's a journey that will lead to spiritual healing, joyous living, peace of mind, and a greater understanding of our purpose in life. Thank you for joining us on this episode of Faith Explorations. Remember, through prayer, worship, obedience, and fellowship with other believers, we can grow in intimacy with God and find true fulfillment in Him. If you enjoyed today's discussion and want to explore more topics related to spirituality, be sure to subscribe to our podcast. Make sure to follow us on Facebook, YouTube, and TikTok. And visit us at BibleKeeper.com for more resources that will enrich your faith journey. Join us next time as we continue to explore matters of faith and spirituality. Until then, may God bless you abundantly.